Hi guys, let me introduce to you the beauty and history of my hometown, Tumungini. The name of Tumawini originated from the name of the big trees found in a population called Mawini. It is said that when some Spaniard wanted to know the name of the trees, they asked a native saying, Como se llama el grande leña? Se bastu? The native not knowing what the Spaniard said, picked the last word he heard and answered, Tumawini. In terms of the architecture, one of the treasure of our town, Tumuini, was our church, the St. Matthias Parish Church. The Church of Tumuini was first built of light materials by Fray Francisco Nunez and dedicated to the patron saint, San Matthias, in the year 1707. The church of a stone with a unique cylindrical bell tower, the only of its kind in the Philippines, was constructed by Father Domingo Forto in the year 1783 and completed in the year 1805. Partly damaged during World War II and repaired into its original form by the faithful of Tumawini. This church was declared a National Historical Landmark on February 24, 1989. Some of the houses here in my town still have this kind of old banga where, back in the times, they use it as a storage of water to drink from the well. One of the tradition or belief from our ancestors that we still practice until now is when there is a celebration, um, before we eat the food that we prepared, we need to give an ally first or in Ibanag, we call it Tunnak or tunnag. It is a practice where we place a small amount of food in every occasion for what we prepared to give an ally to our, our loved ones who passed away. There you go. That was the history of my hometown, Tumawini. Hope you learned something and appreciate it. Mabalo!